So the reason why I'm showing you guys this tutorial is in the past I've had a few issues with exporting um, animations and even models from Maya to Blender. Usually you go with the OBJ or using an FBX but um, there's always going to be issues when the two softwares collide. But I'm going to show you a way to export the entire scene from Maya, even if it's an animation, to Blender. So I've got a uh, model that's rigged in with an animation. Uh, I used this model for a movie last year. So what you want to do is, if you want to export the entire scene uh, from Maya to Blender, first you want to go to uh, Create up here and go Sets, and you want to create a set. And the next step, you want to go to Cache and Alembic Cache and export all to Alembic. You want to click this little option square right here and it will give you all the options. You want to make sure it's in time slider but if you want to fiddle around with these settings uh, go ahead and it's going to show you the, um, the the number of frames in between it's going to export so I currently have it from these numbers to that and uh, I got more options right here. Make sure all these options are ticked um, if you're new to this and then simply select export all and then uh, you want to select your directory. I'm just going to select my desktop, name it, go test, and go export all. And I'll start calculating. It'll take a while and it's going to go through all the frames. And it'll be done very soon. And that's it. So if I go to my desktop, there's my limbic file. It's got an ABC file. And there it is. So if you want to import it to Blender, you want to open up Blender. I'm just going to delete all these uh, things right here. You want to go to File, Import, Alembic, ABC, .abc, and you want to go find it. Uh, so my desktop, right there. You can change the scale around, but we'll leave it as it is, and go Import Alembic. And there it is. There's your animation. So if I go to my time slider, There you go, my entire animation, the scene itself, has been imported. Now if you simply select the object and go to the um, object data panel, um, sorry, modifiers panel, you can see that it selected the um, ABC file. Now for uh, if you save this scene and delete this uh, ABC file that we created, it will get rid of the animation. So make sure that you save this in the directory that you're saving the um, your Blender file. And uh, that's it, you guys. If you have any questions, just uh, comment uh, in, uh, below this video. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.